Good evening, I'm Jennifer Griswold. At the start of the new year, Nebraska raised the minimum age to buy tobacco products from 18 to 19. Days before that, President Donald Trump signed a bill to bump the minimum age to 21. And as reporter Kent Lutzen finds out, the difference in state and federal laws have raised questions from business owners and law enforcement. Everybody woke up and it happened. Overnight, smoke shops across the nation were told to stop selling tobacco products to anyone under the age of 21 rather than 18. To add to the shakeup, Nebraska law raised its minimum age to 19, leaving Nebraska tobacco shops confused about what age to enforce. Is it 19 or 21? There was people coming in that didn't understand. We were still trying to figure it out. The people were, were uh, very confused. Jason Brock and his brother, owners of Habits Glass and Goody, say there was limited guidance on who they could and couldn't sell to. Jason says they're in the process of creating new signs with a minimum age requirement of 19, but due to federal law changes, those plans were put on hold. It's hard to give people direction when they come to us looking for the direction, but we're not the ones that set the rules or the laws. But yet we have to be the ones to tell them what is A and B when we're still trying to figure that out ourselves because of the lack of direction. 11 days after federal law went into effect, Nebraska's Attorney General Doug Peterson released a statement, quote, advising Nebraska law enforcement and pertinent state agencies that enforcement shall be limited to enforcement of the state law unless the Nebraska legislature changes the minimum age from 19 to 21, as suggested by the federal Tobacco 21 Act. This means Nebraska law enforcement is to enforce the state law of 19, not the federal law at 21 years of age. However, after talking with multiple law enforcement agencies like Omaha Police and the Douglas County Sheriff's Office, as well as tobacco shop owners. There is still some confusion. We reached out to the Attorney General's office for clarification, but they didn't elaborate beyond their statement. This happening overnight, I only know that the, that the federal government is, is ready or understanding what their role even is at this point. So um, I think those things are, are, are still are going to be telling and we'll find out. In Omaha, Kent Lutzen, 3 News Now. Jason says he's sticking with the minimum age of 19. As for other smoke shops in Omaha, some plan to follow the state law, others the federal law.